In this video, we're going to look at the production of good health. Health economics assumes a production process for producing good health. Good health is a function of inputs. People take medical care, diet, exercise, environment, genes, and biological factors all affect a person's health. So we can think of good health as a function of these various inputs. Let's suppose the production function of good health is given by H equals M times Y. The price of medical care, M, is $2, and the price of everything else, Y, is $1. person has $1,000 to spend on inputs. Solve for the input mix that maximizes good health. So the person has a constraint, $1,000 to spend on medical care, which is $2 a unit, and Y, everything else, which is $1 a unit. So we're going to first solve for the marginal products. I'm going to take the partial derivative of this health production function with respect to M, medical care, and we get back Y. And then we take a partial derivative of the health production function with respect to Y, everything else, and we get back M. Setting up our maximizing condition, trying to get the most health that we can from our limited budget. We're going to take the marginal product of medical care divided by the price of medical care, and we want that to equal the marginal product of good Y divided by the price of good Y. So making our substitutions, the marginal product of medical care we saw was Y. The price of medical care is 2. The marginal product of good Y is M and divided by the price of good y, which is 1. We have this condition, and just solving for y, y equals 2m. Rewriting our budget constraint, and where we have y, we'll now substitute in 2m. So 1,000 equals 4m, dividing through by 4, m equals 250. So this consumer should buy 250 units of medical care. And in terms of the other good Y, since Y equals 2M and M is 250, the person should buy 500 units of the other good in order to maximize good health. Okay, that's it.